Hey gamers, I'm introing this video. Is it even gonna be up on YouTube right now? Am I talking to anybody? I'm talking to the Twitch chat. They're right down below, I'm like fighting off a burp. This may not ever go up on YouTube, but I'm just doing the video just in case wild stuff happens. Somebody in the chat told me to play the demo on hard mode by taking off the, the woman's clothes. And I thought I had heard that somewhere, and then I was like, Whoa, wait, were they just trolling? Is that like a silly, a little silly, like, joke, you know? And, and but apparently it's a real thing. So we're gonna do that. We're gonna do that on normal mode, but like, again, if you take, it's one of those risk reward things. The game gets tougher, but the reward boner oh shit no I can't do this chat I can't do this I uh I I freaking I turned off the I was making tiktoks and I turned off the dialogue so that I could get music from the game so I gotta like restart it and again unfortunately something I mentioned earlier as of now, I can't. I can't skip through the cutscene, even though I've seen it three. several Their times now. The objective is the capture or dispatchment of the Elder Nation. Pods entering atmosphere. And Aetherum, those videos are 1440p high quality bitrate. Shout out YouTube. Time fly by. That's that's visual storytelling. Okay. Yo, Rocky McFly. Thanks for 21 months of support. Appreciate you. It's called cool, Duke, baby. I know this. Oh, DJ Kanto, get in line. I don't know what that means. I meant like sit back, buckle up is what I meant, not get in line. Get in, uh, Take a number, get in line. <laughs> we'll leave your number, we could text you whenever your seat is ready, when your table's ready. I don't know, Kotschloff, I had a long day, man. <laughs> I had to watch Godzilla, man. It was a tough, tough night last night. Where are we dropping, chat? I'm gonna go with Tilted Towers. Oh. Hmm, let's look at this right here. 07531, pod landing complete. Removing physical shield, opening hatch. Come on. Come on. Come on. It's not opening. Oh, music. Taki. Eve, are you alright? Taki's fuegos. This place is dangerous. Take my hand. So the story with this game, like, we were basically kind of created to... Chad, look away, okay? You horny bastards. We were made to eventually kill all the aliens here. You horny bastards. Taki's an absolute baddie, yeah. This way to the boat. 
one thing I absolutely love about this video game, it is, I mean, just this demo so far, can't really say anything for the rest of the game, but the demo, wildly good optimization. Like, you have three graphics modes, you have frame rate, balance gives you like, a, I think 1440p with like 50 to 60 frames. And it's like, it's awesome. I, I rarely have noticed like m many frame drops or anything like that or inconsistent frame jut or anything like that. It's it's really, really damn good. I'll take care of this side. Oh wait, so can I take off the suit already? Oh, I can't take off the suit yet. Because again, if you take off the suit, if you want to be a little horny freak, then uh, you, uh, that's like the hardest difficulty. I see you still have your combat senses. Great. Coordinates? Like some of these basic attacks do kind of not feel great. They kind of feel like pretty basic. Makes the combat, Jesus. The <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Everybody look. You horny bastards. This is what we wanted for the hardest difficulty. This is what. That was close. This is like a lot. This is, <laughs> this is a lot. <laughs> so many things are moving, man. It's crazy. Jesus. What I needed this guy to do Watch on that stab, this is going to be tough to hit. Kick, uh, it's going to be weird to keep hitting pause to try to talk to you. <laughs> it's just, this is a lot of stuff happening right now. A lot of outlines, a lot of, a lot of movements. Um, am I able to, hold on, let me just, no, I can't do that. Um, what I wanted that bad guy to do when, when the stab happens, I wanted it to do like the the orc from uh, Fellowship, the the main the main Urukai who like has the uh, like brings uh, Aragorn closer to him. He's like, eh, he does that thing. I wanted that guy to do that thing as an as a wink and an homage to the Fellowship of the Ring. And I would have been like, that's from Lord of the Rings. All right, everybody, don't look anymore. All right. Tucky! So very similar to Lies of P where if you just block Let's go. or if you don't block on man, it's <laughs> just shit. God damn. Um, if you don't block on time, you're going to like get a little bit of a health chip loss and it's gonna break your stagger meter. My body frame. Take this. It's first aid. Thank you. Just a lot happening right now. You horny bastards. There's more of them. Up again. I don't think there are different weapons in this game. I think it's all about kind of upgrading the current thing. You, like, there's different guns, but I don't know if there's different swords or anything. Do the Let's hits and blocks feel as good and impactful as Lies of P? Um, when you parry shit on time, I'd say absolutely, yeah. The hits feel kind of, kind of loose. Like, Unless you're in a boss fight where all of your senses are elevated because of like the music and the spectacle of it. But fighting normal people like this, uh, the swings and everything don't feel 
the best. They they feel serviceable. They feel okay, you know. And it's wild how similar to Lies of P this is, where it's like it's an unproven developer. This isn't looking good. In this genre, like making a souls like I got a lot of like I'm getting a lot of flack on YouTube comments of being like this isn't a souls like, but like you know what I mean. It's it's going for something in that direction of video game, and they've never done one of these. And it's optimized incredibly well. It looks really damn good. And I think they're doing a pretty great job of replicating that, you know, the sense of urgency whenever you're in a boss fight. Oh, my God. Just a lot of movement. Just a... No. No. You horny bastards. The squad's life signs. We're the only two left. Is there a two-end weapon option? No, not that I've seen so far. Eve. Eve. I don't feel... Together. Man, like, I... I really hope a relative... Tucky. Doesn't turn on my stream right now. Like, I... <laughs> we haven't completed our mission. I want to be judged now so, so roughly this for this. Understand? <laughs> Just going to take a little screenshot for this real quick. Just for the Instagram story. Eve, are you ready? Jesus. And he's talking to himself. Yeah, so apparently, yeah, so it's not apparently. I'm doing this. I'm doing this for the challenge only, okay? Don't, I don't, I will, I will be receiving no judgment from anybody in chat. When you play without the your suit of armor, it, the game is more difficult because because the game's more difficult because there's not a whole lot of of blood in your brain for brain activity. Like the blood has gone to other regions. You know. Oh, bitch ass. I didn't know that dude had that move. Oh my god. It wasn't an alpha, but it was a strong one. Just gonna get another shot real quick. Well. Yeah. Even better than during training. You were all together. But then <laughs> Her spine's Damage fucked up. She's got serious. spine bifida. I don't know what that is. We have to find the supply camp. Wait, Eve. I hear something. Eve! Eve, are you all right? Come on, come on.
Whatever this is, I can't wait to fight it. A sack of fluid gets in there and presses vertebrae apart. Open. Ooh, gross. That sounds terrible. Slightly your door. Thanks for nine months. Oh shit, Stella Blade. Piranha. Hmm. Let's look at this right here. No! Ah! Oh! Uh. Eve. Get out of here. I don't know if there's anything cooler when like a character in a piece of media is dying and they're like run like that's so sick I, I just love that it's such a overused trope but it's awesome <laughs> it's so awesome now here's the thing this moment shocked me and like surprised me in a way that made me you know, feel like dread or fear in my body. And when that should happen right at the beginning of, of Rise of the Ronin, no spoilers, but kind of spoilers in the first like 10 minutes, I was just like, oh man, I feel nothing right now. It's similar to, yeah, it's it's exactly similar to that, Scoopal. This goes way deeper than we could have ever imagined. It's quiet. Still, make sure to stay cautious. He's like, can you put clothes on? What's... It's where the Alpha and AT buy is. And this dude just... What a looker. What a looker Adam is. Beautiful jawline. Beautiful chin... Uh, cheek structure. Venzero! Thanks for the follow, Venzero. Appreciate you. Now, get ready. I'll be supporting with the drone. One thing, though. I wish the drone was also, like, the shooting kind of thing that you have in Nier Automata. So must be 8 or 7. Yes. I already forget that little dude's name. This was the final battlefield of civilization. It was also known as a truly colossal city. A Gantz movie on I don't I don't know what that is, DJ Kenta. Yeah, her feet are in so much pain, but she's also like cyborg. The sky. A strange sensation. Just like augmented human, you know. This must be Earth's rain. We can admire the scenery later. We have a job to do here. It could be something you unlock later. And that it that that does become one God Jesus. That becomes <laughs> that is so distracting. That becomes one thing that makes it a bit tough to criticize this game or to talk about what it doesn't have because I don't necessarily know what it doesn't have yet. You know. Taki. Taki's a baddie. Adam, baddie. Natiba, terrible word. Like, not a cool sounding word at all. It just sounds like noise, you know? Is this game out? No, it comes out April 28th, I believe. Falling debris. Be careful. Something is coming. The crustacean type enemy. Oh yeah, a little sum again. See ya! Uh, the whole, all of the videos that I posted on, Jesus, the videos that I posted on YouTube, I was never hitting R2 to gather stuff. I know it told me right off the, the rip to do that, and I never picked them up. I thought that those little green bits were health, and I was like, well, I'm full heals, so that's why I can't pick it up. Sekiro blocking, it's more similar to, to Lies of P. It's a bit slower. And you're not gonna be like ding 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 like it's Sekiro's always been like the fastest version of a parry slash deflection 
to me. Um, an encrypted code in the memory it, it's way more similar to Lies of it's P. It's a security code. A type of entry permit. Oh, oh they, got, they got auto pickup? Shut the front door. Oh my god, they do. Also, I can uh, turn on short ponytail, chat. I got short hair now. See, I got short hair. Just don't look at all the movement. There's a lot of secondary action. I, and it makes no sense that it's part, it's in the gameplay menu. I don't understand why it's there, but I also kind of love that it's there. You know what I mean? The hair physics though, really cool. Okay, isn't that sick? Why does she run like that? She's a cyborg, man. Who knows? What engine in this? I want to assume it's uh, Unreal Engine 4. Similar to Lies of P, where they're like... They're at the end of a very, very capable engine, and they're getting the most out of it. It worked. It's UE4? Okay, yeah, that's what I figured. of the city's unstable terrain. You'll get used to it soon. You just hear Adam like, Tacky, quick, uh, stop moving. Stay there for a bit. He just <laughs> take it. What, what are you doing, Adam? Uh, nothing. Just taking some screenshots, observing the environment. One of my favorite things about the little Adam drone is that Adam lights the environment for you as well. So if you're like in a coming up, we'll be in some darker hallways that uh There's a Legion camp in a place like this. That like you know, Adam's light cats cast shadow on the enemies and it things start to look really awesome. Adam and Eve? Oh shit, bro. <laughs> Oh, fuck. That's crazy. He is the GOAT, the greatest of all time. I just realized that right now. That's, ins that's insane. That's insane. <laughs> you're a genius. <laughs> you're, a fuck you're a fucking genius. Uh, and here we are at a bonfire, but again, it's not and, and when you sit down at the bonfire the enemies Reset and, and respawn, but it's not a souls like it's definitely not a souls like quit calling it that Andy It is absolutely not a souls like I Haven't watched any yet DJ Kento my, my last yesterday was spent Getting all the the videos for Stellar Blade ready for today when uh, when they all released. It's a Souls like without souls. Well, I mean, Elden Ring is a Souls game that doesn't have souls, right? Like I, I don't, I don't think the concept of ha of you dropping things that you have to go back and collect after you die. That's not what makes a game a Souls game for me anymore. Like to me, it 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 has to do with fighting an enemy that has these highly telegraphed attacks, and there's the risk reward of do I want to attack here or do I want to dodge or try to parry it because. I can't just be willy-nilly hacking and slashing. This isn't like, you know, every, every little movement here has a consequence. And I have to like be extremely careful. You gotta be methodical with your thinking or you'll get punished. This isn't just like a beat em up, you know, Devil May Cry type game. Um, similar to Lies of P. Like if you decide to go for that heal in that moment, you're gonna get your ass clobbered. It's the most forgiving of a Souls-like game uh, of this genre. Um, 
because the game also wants you to feel badass. And so you can buy a bunch of really slick ass abilities and upgrade them and feel like a, a, a goddamn action hero, you know? But like, if this game was just tap square a lot to just attack, attack, attack without really actually having to worry about what the enemy is doing, like you can't interrupt your heal, you can't interrupt your attacks. Um, that's what I would. That's what I would say. Like, oh, this was obviously influenced by Souls games. And since there's not a word for that, I'm just gonna call it a Souls-like. Like, now a lot of games are doing that, and it's a very, very loose comparison. But a lot of it just has to do with difficulty and, um, what's wrong? The, again, that risk reward of deciding whether to attack or dodge. I really hope they have button remapping as well, style gem. We have to stay alert. Yeah, the skill tree is pretty crazy. Um, did we already, did we use the shop? I can change the music. I'm so bad at dodging, by the way. I'm terrible at dodging. Ow, bitch ass. Ow! The fuck? Souls-like mechanics are... Are... Have hit most games now as well. Yeah, I totally agree. Like, I... Well, I think a lot of it was just, like... It became the standard because... It's such a damn good idea that everybody was like, You know what? That actually feels incredible. Let's, let's all do that, you know? Remember, you can always charge those attacks and they'll do like even more. They take longer to to get going, but it's pretty pretty sick. One of the Legion's old supply boxes. Do you think there's anything useful? Well, it's Legion, so compatibility shouldn't be an issue. Make sure to take everything. Hey, na, 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 na. You see the rapids below. If you fall, over. Yeah, being a parry god is way cool than being a dodge god. It just feels better to me. And that's why anybody who watched any of my like recent streams or anybody who There's watched Eliza P play through, I would have done a lot better at that game had I dodged more, but it just feels so good to parry. And this game has very satisfying sound effects to make those parries feel rewarding oh my god oh my god ggs oh i thought it was over for me i also love the idea of like having an air dash it's not crazy and you also i will say you move a lot slower than i thought and maybe these are all things that upgrade later but when you're in battle like I feel like I'd be moving forward more. Meant to dodge, born to parry. Oh, this, I was supposed to be doing the air attack here. Oh, dude, I didn't even know there was a guy behind me. Go oh, fuck yourself. Leave me alone. You do kind of like feel stationary. If you're just like hitting square and square and square, you almost feel like you're a like a turret that is only meant for melee. <laughs> oh yeah, oh I know. 
Also, how weird is it that they call the system groggy here too, just like they did in Liza P. I thought that was weird as shit that Liza P did it. And when this game did it too, I was like, maybe that's just like a, maybe that's a term that I didn't know developers were gonna be using. I usually just go with staggered, you know? Oh yeah, the soundtrack is really damn cool. Can you please hit that thing? It's the Korean translation. Yeah, that's what I assumed. Bitch ass, where do you think you're going? Also, this guy only turned invisible like in this fight. Come on, come on, do your thing. Let's just star you. Yeah, I think Greg called it the uh, Starro from uh, the Suicide Squad from DC. I love how I never even equipped any of those, these Omni Bolt things the first time I played it. I'm sure that message popped up and I skipped right by it in effort to like, in an effort to make a joke. That's the price I pay for comedy, you know? Are other cities in a similar state? By comparison, this city is looking pretty good. After the colony extinction, most places were nothing but dust. Huh? Wait, there's a fusion cell. Let's open the car's hood. I'm still not quite sure what a fusion cell does. Oh, surprise. I know, like, I end up slotting it in some it's a high thing later, but I don't know what Next they do. That, Earth's night isn't dark yet. Oh, it's the previous generation of the Infinity Cell. Be sure to keep that. It's very valuable. This is insane. <laughs> this is crazy. I dig the music too, Omega Archetype, and in the boss fights, it gets like insanely hype and, and awesome. Where is there's a oh yeah this this look at that look at that little son of a bitch right there chat look at this little piece of garbage this guy scared the shit out of me every time Oh, that was so crucial. That was so crucial and necessary. I'm definitely not surviving this. Hey, yo, stop. Back away. Back away. Hi. Aye, that's all it took. That's all it took. I shouldn't have risked it. I shouldn't have risked it. Just tuning in, haven't watched all kind of funny content. So if a so if it's a repeat, my bad. Are you in, invested in the plot? And I actually mean, I actually mean the plot. Um, it seems to be a story. Um, oh Jesus. Um, uh, in short, yes, I kind of am because. And I only really learned this when I read one of the little like descriptions, but it's we were created to kill these enemies and I got a feeling that like, oh, we're the baddies and I'm gonna have to like change things later on, you know? And I, I, I think that's pretty neat. Oh, fuck. Hey, stop that. Yeah, for sure the plot. I love the plot though. No, I didn't mean to knock that away. No. This is a good place to like use your environment barrels. Yeah, eat shit. Oh, that thing's gonna kill me. 
Come over here, bitch. Come over here. <laughs> yeah, eat shit. You too. All three of you. Oh, there's still one more. Oh, this son of a gun. Is this a demo? It sure is. It's available on PSN right now. Thank you for subscribing for two months. The plug. I'm not going to beat this dude. Actually, I might be able to if I heal. Okay. Okay. I'm definitely taking hits way worse. never took on that one dude in there. I didn't beat that one dude. I hate you. Why why you're still here? Get a get a life. Ah! Ah! The thing that sucks about that death is that I, uh, these dudes respawn. Like if I, I, I think that like the dude I just killed is gonna respawn again. The larger son of a gun. See how sick is it that like Adam's light casts a shadow? It's the coolest dynamic thing. It's just like having like a player torch. Like, give me... Oh, shit. Dang it, I didn't want to use a heal here. Give me a passive ability where... Perfect parrying gives me, like, the tiniest bit of health back. Do it again, bitch. Oh yeah, see? Man, those those abilities are really OP and awesome. I also tried my darndest to try to climb this last time. Oh. What do you gotta say? The memory sticks fried. Is the level design also akin to a Souls game or is it more it's definitely more linear it's closer to Lies of P where there might be a couple of little crevices here and there that you can find if you seek it out, but it's not gonna be like this mind-blowing amount of level design. I also don't know what's up with this passcode. And I tried my hardest to climb this freaking thing. But like, why would you put a stone in there if I can't do anything there? Like, you know what I mean? So, terrible design. <laughs> Oh, I love the UI Lucid Dream. I love the futurism sort of vibes to it. You know what? With that memory stick we did pick up. Oh, I guess it was just fully fried. I was hoping that whatever that memory stick was i could go into here and look at it and maybe try to figure out what the what the code is for that thing combo attack enhancement gear we're putting that on we're not putting on the suit all right i'm still not cheating is this gonna go again this way Oh, thank God I beat him. There are traces of markers left behind by the Legion. Oh, this dude's gonna cut. 
Oh no, never mind, he's dead. What happened? Oh. What is going on? Oh, is it just... I think all the barrels are blowing up over there. You gonna come to life? Of course you are. Do it again, you bitch. Shit, actually. One second. <laughs> hold up, hold up, hold up. Oh man, this dude almost grabbed me. So I think every once in a while you'll find like your dead squad mates and then you may your memories live on forever. Number of beta co It's kind of like collecting hard pieces, I'm assuming. The blue indicator means that if you perfect dodge, you'll follow up with uh another attack. Force remnants. Oh wait, hold up. Maybe save us. Oh, I was thinking maybe this was the code for that one treasure chest I just saw. Yeah, she's a cyborg. She's naked. Is there a lore reason why she's naked? I made her naked. But uh, hear me out. <laughs> uh, it's because Chad dared me. No, because I already I already beat the demo a couple times. And if you play without the suit, you're essentially making the game tougher on yourself because you don't have armor. Shield is disabled when you put on this skin suit. You don't have a shield. And your shield is like your block ability. If you look at the bottom left, I have no dots there next to SH. Meaning that like if I had the suit on and if I just held block, that would chip first before health would go down. All the markers placed by the Legion. I mean, you're probably telling me where to go now, which I know where to go, but I'm, I'm looking for this fucking code. Boob! It says boob! It says booby! What? That's crazy. Oh, you know what I'm assuming? I'm thinking that maybe if I, when I keep playing, because eventually you get to a spot where you can backtrack, uh, like fast travel, and I may be able to come back here and I might have a code later on. I just didn't know it at the time. Here's a weird spot. I was like, ooh, I can, I can explore further here. Wait, can I? And then, like, I kind of wasn't sure what else there was to find. Oh, wait. Oh, shit. Actually, no, I never went this high. No, I did find this. Never mind. I had gone through the other way. This makes a lot more sense now. Never mind. I take it back. This makes a lot more sense. Because last time I was like, how do I get up to these other poles? But I was going at it from the wrong direction. So that is cool. That's not something I found last time uh, during my first playthrough. Yeah, watch out for the yellow lines. Beware, everybody beware. There's yellow lines. This game's woke. <laughs> All right, chat, you, re you ready for this? We'll get the music going high. Decade.
decades have passed since the appearance of Natibus and the evacuation of humankind of the colony. They say the airborne squad is descending to rescue the remaining humankind, but there's no sign. We can't do this anymore. I can't do this anymore. Put, put that on the fucking reel. Put that on the reel! Put it on the reel! Oh, that's for probably over there. Oh no, this is for something else. Boa Core, I remember this. still has the security code registered. It also has record of a message log. Scan complete. Put that on the goddamn real chat. It's unbelievable, the type of stuff that I'm just <laughs> pulling off day to day. You know what I mean? It's like, it's like when people watch, the, you know, Michael Jordan. It's just like, wow, this guy's just doing wild stuff. It's Steph in his prime. Nick Cam, 28 months of support. Thank you for 28 here. months. Do you see the ladder behind me? Appreciate you, Nick Cam. Thank you for the love and support. Thank you, Omega Buster, for 13 months of tier one love. Locked and loaded. Sky is a bird. Subscribe for four months. Thank you, Sky is a bird. You horny bastards. Appreciate you very, very much. Serious question, Andy. When you do become a voice actor, will you be ready to read that back dozens and dozens of times with a director giving you notes? <laughs> you know it, Doc. I already recorded lines for my starring role in the... It's not starring role, but in the upcoming Kill It With Fire 2. The game where you kill spiders. The game where you're a spider hunter. Can't reach the ladder. You all ready for Water some Last of Us? Try using the plank. Some Last of Us physics? Do you play a spider? You can actually, Cameron. I don't play a spider though. I play like one of the annoying dudes that you end up like reading dialogue or you end up like finding uh, audio logs from. Jace the drone. You gotta stay gaming, bro. How do you ascend? I still love the idea a few days ago when Ben Starr needs you to fight a copy of himself voice acted by you. I would love to be a Clive Rossfield imper uh, impersonator NPC or similar to like a shirtless Spider-Man situation where you're walking down the street and you see a guy who's just like short and chubby and out of shape. And people are like, it, it's almost like when you go to Hollywood to take photos with like the ripoff Captain America costume guy, you know? Excuse me. Get up there. Thank you. Bear King, that voiceover deserves a sub. Wow, we Bear King. If there was ever an argument that I could make that solidifies my proclamation that he is the GOAT, the greatest of all time. This is the latest example. Let's activate the new bonfire. Non-open world games can really shine with graphics. Dude, that's what I'm saying, bro. So much movement in here. There's so much movement. And performance is phenomenal in this game. This game is very, very optimized. I have one skill point. And I haven't really... I'm going to save it. Because later on, they make you upgrade to something else. Executes the enemy from behind. Can only be used on enemies that aren't in combat. Oh. So I can't, I can't get around dudes and souls them. Interesting. Well, then, how, I mean, I guess you're just able to stealth mode then? Aerial blow. Reflection can only be used upon successful, perfect dodge of an enemy's attack. Counters and stuns the enemy and temporarily increases attack speed. This is a combo attack skill. After a perfect dodge, hold square. No, I never ever perfect dodge. 
I'm so terrible at it. Can only be used upon a successful parry of an enemy's attack. Moves quickly. Yes. 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 One million percent. One million percent. That's the that's the call. And here's an even cooler aspect of all this shit. You can enter a training mode at these bonfires. And you could just practice. Isn't this the cool like Yes, this game is is fairly difficult in in some ways on normal difficulty, but there's there are a lot of ways to help get better. I've never even seen this enemy. So check it out. Man, I could like tell the enemy to do special attacks only or all attacks or attacks off. So now it's not going to attack. This is so sick. The guy was like, oh, fuck. Why can't I attack it? This dude looks like he's straight out of Anthem. I'm not sure how you change, like, the enemy types. I kind of wish you could cycle through different enemy types to be like, oh, that's the that move that it does. That's like a three hit combo it does. What what are the parry timings there? It's so sick. So sick. Whoa. Holy shit. I got to do that again. I forget I forgot how to do that. Oh, I don't have the ability to I don't have that blink yet, I don't think. Yeah, no, I don't have that yet. But I get that later. But it's so cool. Yeah, I think it plays like Lies of P Sabretooth, uh, but it looks like Platinum Games made it. So it does have over the top, like, cool action abilities, but you're not just hacking and slashing away willy nilly and trying to, like, combo things together. You're just trying to, like, not die, you know? How much is this? Yeah, I'll, I'll, yeah I freak it. I'll buy that. Pulse grenade. I think the gaming community might as well say any game with combat like this is more like Ocarina of Time than Souls at this point. Might as well go back to the roots. Yeah, I mean, I I disagree because in I think the thing that sets it apart is the difficulty aspect where you can't necessarily get one shot in Ocarina of Time if you take a hit, you know? Putting the fusion cells out here. If you're just hacking it, hacking and slashing away, you can, like, cancel out of moves and things like that. I see you picked the best costume. Look, chat told me that if you take the costume off, you don't have a shield, then this is the hard mode. I've already beaten the demo. Why not challenge myself to not get a boner on stream? Um, what was in here again? Oh, yeah, this little son of a gun. It's so funny you say that, Camp, because... Um, that... That sh that ladder slide is, like, identical to Nier Automata. Ah! 
damn it, dude. I still don't fully know when to dodge there. God, the lighting looks so good. Yeah, I was mentioning that too. It, said, it reminded me a lot of like playing Astral Chain or playing Scarlet Nexus. Adam, I will stream this one, absolutely. I, the boss fights are so Don't freaking you know amazing. It's a map. A map? How do you synchronize the location on the map? I <sighs> <sighs> get it, because she doesn't know about maps. It's not digital. She doesn't. Uh, she's a digital girl living in a digital world. I don't know how to I don't know when to move away from that. I don't know if I have to move away when it's blue. Or when the attack actually comes at my face. Pause. Take that back. Or uh, delete that from the bot. They explain the blue move further. That's when you get when you have blink though, right? I don't have blink yet. Jump scare. Hey. Man, I didn't block any of those well. There it is. I also forget you can like jump and attack and that's like part of the combat as well. Diamond Chuck says, love you, Andy. How far are you into Dragon Song with two? It gets batshit crazy at the end. I am still, I am still very early in. What was this? Boa Core? Nailed it. Nailed it. Um, I'm still very, very early early on, and I'm having a phenomenal time with it. Yes, exactly, Julio. Exactly. Are oh, ready for this again, chat? You ready for this? Here we go. <clears throat> Everybody call all the voice call every voice actor you know. Get ready. <clears throat> Let me warm up my voice real quick. The network has been destroyed. I'm completely disconnected from the colony's data link. We have nowhere to fall back to. Is this an Atibus doing? Is the colony safe? What happened to Mother Sphere? I lost track of time. Even that won't automatically correct itself. For the sake of my own sanity, I must keep track of the calendar by force editing my memory stick. Fucking ship that, dude! Have you played Nier Automata? I have, goddamn. And unfortunately, I only ever did like, I only beat it one and a half times. And about a year and a half or two years ago, I was like, you know what? It's time to do like my full Nier Automata playthrough experience. And nobody fucking watched. <laughs> so I <it> stopped. <laughs> I stopped. It got like 10 views. And it broke my heart.
Whoa, I didn't even see this ladder. Oh, this is where I came from. I'm so stupid, bro. <laughs> idiot. <laughs> I'm so stupid. But this is the shortcut, by the way, chat. This is where we were. This is where we fought the, you know, all the little enemies right there with the barrels. Shortcut. Yo, what up, Gilbert? How's it going, homie? We already beat that bug there. Oh, looks like this used to be a library. Are these boxes displayed on the wall storage devices? Just give me cat's shadows Sorry. all over the place. They can only store up to one megabyte of data. Let my let shadows be everywhere. It's a waste of resources. It looks so good, man. Again, particularly when you're fighting enemies like this, the lighting just looks incredible. Oh, dog, I have no health. I didn't even realize that. I oh shit. God dang. Jeez, Louise. I I did not even notice how little health I had. Uh, hey, but guess what? We unlocked the shortcut, gamers. So don't even fret. Don't even worry, your little silly faces. Is there a treasure in there? Yeah, I got some monies there. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Oh, bitch. What I need from Adam is to like, I need him to like cheer me on. So badass, dude. Remember her sword is that hair piece that's like kind of dangling. Wild. Wild technology. The crack is quite deep. It's going to be difficult to pass. Unreal Engine 4. We'll have to go across, past the parking tower. A lot of butt crack is crazy. <laughs> He's stunned trying to figure out why you're naked. Can I? Okay, no, I can't. Whoa, jump scare! <laughs> Shit. That's the, that hurts. Ow. Shit. That crack is quite deep. Oh, hold on, let me let me do it. That crack is quite deep. This may not be the best way to go. A, a best way, not not breast. Two titties. Are all these dudes just dead? Yeah, all these dudes are dead. Oh, nice. Give me a little money. A little bit of monies. Locked door. Can't do nothing with that, gamers. I have no idea when the PC release comes out. God damn. Don't go quite yet, because the final boss is about to happen. You're about to be more sold. You're going to buy copies for your whole family. May your memories be born forever. A supply camp in a place like this. Supply camp? What's that? It's a depot set up by the airborne squad. And a PS5. Yeah, this is a PS5 exclusive. Looks like it's been abandoned for a long time. 
How come they set up a camp in a corner like this? Well, the supply camp also serves as an important base. I didn't pick up his automatic. Or oh, you can switch it to automatic, Lucid G. I just did that a little while ago. I didn't even know what happened until chat told me. It could also mean that this place is one. very dangerous. Then I guess this place could be useful for us. Depot. Supply camps feature more d devices than regular camps. You can use a repair console to enhance weapons, increase rechargeable tumbler count, and upgrade your exospine. So, I gotta assume that whenever you're about to fight a boss, they give you a supply camp as opposed to like the normal campsite. Also, you can upgrade your drone, craft nano suits, and fast travel to other camps. What do you mean, Rudio? What happened? What does that mean? This, here's where we get the blink ability. Oh, walked around with no spine. <laughs> Press square to train your skills. And this is where we get that little blink. Oh, I gotta hit forward, that's right. So my sword will glow blue when I know that I can do that shit. Do it again, bitch. Do it again. And I do like some cool like... Da, da, da. Oh shit, man. I didn't even know I could do shit like that. That's awesome. Oh, I hit the wrong thing. I gotta go forward. So awesome. So cool. Awesome. Yo, Glitch Gloom, thanks for two months of tier one subscription love. Thank you very, very much. Locked and loaded. Supporting the stream, supporting the dream. What I want to do is, well, actually, we, we have one other skill point. I was wanting to go, like, level up more before we take on the boss, but I, I figured I could probably add another skill, maybe. Repulse can only be used uh, when an enemy is attempting a fatal attack. Pushes the enemy away, steps back. Oh, nice. That's sick. I remember this one. So let's try this move out. So like they, they they show like a weak point that you just want to attack. Awesome. Glitch Gloom, thank you once again for two months of support. Locked and shout out to Bear loaded. King, Jason Jones, and Diamond Chuck once again. Uh here we can upgrade our Sword. I just love the font treatment and everything. It's so cool. It's, it's so slick looking. And I'm gonna rest first, but I also want I want to fast travel back to the first spot because I think maybe now I might have a code for that other chest. Yeah. For that other uh today. treasure. Thank you for saving me. I 
that's nothing, really. Though I have used up almost all of the exospine materials that I collected over the years. Oh. It's all right. That now means we can help each other. Hey, what do you want me to do? We can track down the Alpha Nativa together. And, well, I'd have trouble making it out here by myself anyway. If you can locate the Hall of Records, you'll have done more than enough. Listen, don't worry. I promise, I'll make sure to repay you. We have a month to finish Dragon's Dogma too, you're so right. Like, this reminds me so much of Near Automata, the music. Alright, let's fast travel back to that first spot, see what's up with that chest. I do need to finish Rebirth. It's just like, man, nobody's watching. It breaks my heart. That may just be one that I don't stream and just post YouTube VODs. Oh shit, it started me way the heck back here. That's kind of sick. Well, let's find that first room. Can I skip by all y'all and just go through the door? I wonder. I cannot. Wait, do I got it? How do I get through the door? Oh, I just, oh I'm an idiot. I'm so stupid. <laughs> I tried walking up to the terminal. Treasures up here? Oh, come on, developers. You gotta put a little treasure up here. What about over here? Oh, I never even like swam in this gross water. Whoa. Oh, I knew it. There's gotta be treasure down here, dude. I got through Rebirth and kind of lost steam, kind of dragging for me. The thing with Rebirth for me is like, whether I'm digging the, the story elements or not, the combat always just kind of keeps me going because I, I enjoy it so, so much, you know? But I don't disagree. Like, man, I was watching, um, I was watching, uh, Syra, Syra Spooks play through Final Fantasy Remake on stream and man that game has so many moments that just drag like crazy the moments that I wasn't around for Mike stream for where Mike like streamed without me that game has some incredibly slow freaking moments oh yeah I'm, pr I'm pretty much past where I needed to be yeah yeah uh, in, in uh in, in rebirth nice man nice The worst part is you're only like halfway. I mean, is that bad though? I don't mind that there's more of the game of Final Fantasy. All right, here it is, Chad. Here it is. This is what I wasn't able to do last time. Eat shit. Man, so fire. God dang. All right, I didn't realize I put the, I forgot I put the volume like way higher. Sorry, chat. That shit must have been really painful in the ears. I just super suck at Queen's Blood. You can just skip that shit though. I don't suck. I'm incredibly good at it. Don't watch that one uh, video I put up on YouTube. Don't watch that shit. 
I'm incredibly good at it. Ignore all... Uh, ignore all evidence that shows otherwise. All right, that chest is gonna be in this room. And there's also this little spooky guy. Piece of garbage. But I just love the way this guy looks like with the lighting here. It looks so good. Look at this, man. I love it. You're doing a great job of lighting this, Adam. was clueless dude had no clue what he was up against yo what up from soft server how's it going homie chat from soft server is working on the dark souls 2 visual overhaul mod and when that sucker is done my journey will begin into the lands between or whatever the fuck they call that place Dang, I still don't know what this is then. I don't even have a hint. I can't even like manually type anything in. That's so weird. Does anybody know the secret here? How to find? I always feel like a creep when I'm like l moving the camera around to look where to go because it just looks like I'm preparing a crank, you know? Love design is is okay for it. It's pretty like it's pretty standard so far. Nothing special. Like unless we get some god tier interconnectedness, this will just be like a, a pretty a pretty standard Souls game. Damn, am I gonna have to run all the way back? I think I am. Maybe this light has a secret. Why would they put a light here? You know what I mean? No. You're being a silly Billy Andy. Did you pick the outfit? Chat, can you tell goddamn why I'm wearing this? Okay, I'm just like, I, 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 I'm sick of trying to defend myself. <laughs> Uh, I've already beat the demo several times, God Dan, and when you take your armor off, it makes the game harder. So I was like, oh, go for the challenge. And it also makes, and the challenge is like trying to prove in court that you're not uh, a deviant. That's the real challenge. Liza P was underrated, I am on, dude, I, it's so funny because somebody in my, uh, on Twitter was like, Liza P is so overrated. <laughs> <laughs> and it's like, I don't know if it is. <laughs> like, I think maybe because you hear like three people that you listen to podcasts say that they love it, that you think it's overrated now. How the fuck do I get it? Oh, I was hitting the wrong button. You can't play this channel while standing up. <laughs> Wait, did I... Oh, I can't fast travel. I thought I thought I could fast travel to any of these spots. I bet you that's something that I could upgrade to later. But I, I, I thought I could fast travel to any bonfire. I don't know, it was just like specifically the big the big base station ones, the big chungus ones. Oh my eyes are burning. My eyes are doing their thing where they're burning. Ow. Hold on, I gotta rub my eyes a lot. Ah. Ah.
Ah. One second, I'm gonna go get eye drops. Squeezes, thanks for subscribing with Prime. Thanks for using your Prime on me. I appreciate the generosity. <laughs> Hope you're doing well. Having a great day of gaming. Oh, cool. That bad guy disappears. How fascinating. I, I feel bad. I told God Dan to stick around for the boss fight, and then I proceeded to walk away for several hours. <laughs> Sorry, God Dan. I didn't mean to do that. Didn't mean to do that to you, homie. Uh, let's hit the bonfire one more time. From Softserve, 10 months of support. Happy to be in the cool NRA, big dog. Thank you, From Softserve. One of my favorite people to follow on Twitter because I just love seeing, I love seeing dynamic shadows, let me tell you. All right, we're just gonna, we're gonna have to rock. We're gonna have to take on this enemy like this. Can we beat the boss? I don't know. With just, with, without our main suit of armor that I have not attempted to beat the boss without shield. Come on, let me get in there. Let me beat your ass, dude. It's always cool. Adam, get back. We're just gaming right now. We're absolutely gaming right now. Oh, I didn't do the move. Damn it. Oh, I hate this shit. I hate this shit. I never know, like, the right way to not get hit by any of that stuff. Uh, leave me alone. Oh, God. Oh, shit. Come on, man. This is so badass. Oh, yeah, baby. Easy peasy, man. I almost died. And then they're like, let's drop it. Let's drop a sizzle reel on your ass just to see how sick this game looks. I can see the space center over there. This is the turret's motion sensor. What do we do now? The drone is different. Yes, this is no longer the drone you knew. So, uh, we upgrade our little drone guy, our Adam Jonas, shoot. 
Something serious seems to have happened. I have to return to Zion. And then you, and then you get that. <laughs> Where the fuck that is? Little birds. Like, if they showed this instead of that PlayStation, like, you know, sit down at a bonfire to collect your blah, blah, blah. Like, if they just showed this, this would have been the most hype shit ever. Fucking awesome. And then when you beat the demo, you can then take on, you get like boss challenge mode, which is a different boss. And you have like more abilities in this, at this point in the game, they give you like extra, they give you a whole bunch of things you can kind of like play around with and see what your melee damage reduction. Fixed damage gear, bonus fixed damage up upon combo attack. Damage reduction, speed increase, faster attack speed sounds awesome. Let's do that. Bonus beta gear charge, whatever the, oh, that's for, gotcha. Let's just go for a full damage kind of thing. Gotta go no shield, I'll oh, go to hell y'all. Come on. You don't want me to do the bayonetta? Can I can I wear the glasses? We'll do the glasses. Chain type exospine increases attack power of combo attacks level 2 or higher. Critical damage increases by 23%. Makes it easier to perfect dodge or perfect parry. This is kind of, that's a cool one. This exo spine of like a larger parry window. Let's take on this little son of a son of a gun. Yeah, I'm definitely getting TOS. I'm getting reported for sure. I already got a heal. God damn. Oh shit, I forgot I can't. Do uh, dodge away from that or a uh, parry that grenade time bitch Grenade, bitch. Hey.
get up, get back here, you little bitch. Oh man, that zip back is some of the coolest shit ever. Oh, I hate this move. This move is so tough to understand what's what the pattern is. It's so weird. Oh God. I didn't know that move could trigger multiple times. No! What the fuck? I did it! You saw me dodge? I, I think I needed to like dodge forward instead of like to the side. That's definitely what it was. Man, I had that shit too, man. It's hiding. There's so much movement. There's so so much movement. Oh, God damn. Whoa! Not having a shield sucks. <laughs> That's the price we pay for being horny. God damn it. Does this have difficulty levels? Uh, yes, it has a story mode and then just normal. And Greg told me when he was trying out story mode that it tells you how to, uh, it tells you like kind of in real time whether you're parrying or dodging at the right moment. And it kind of like corrects you and teaches you how to play, which is pretty cool. Oh, dang. Ah! All right, this shit just got like really hard actually. I was like so close on my first try. The purple attack you want to go, you want you want to dodge backwards. It's like a skill that you also have. I didn't get to do it there. Fuck me, man! Holy shit! Holy shit! This got tough. Yeah, if she threw, if she tried to like kick somebody, I, I could, I mean, this, uh, this woman has the thighs of a goddess. She could fucking just like kick anybody to death. She built like a fucking Olympian. I did have it down the first time. I also forget what moves to like zip back. Ah! 
Get shit up. Uh, 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 uh. Ah! Heal! Fuck! <laughs> oh, I can't dodge that. I always forget about that. Or I can't uh, parry that. Me, man, I missed that. I was too far away from it. So the blue you want to like dodge forward, and the purple you dodge backwards. I was in, the, I was like, my brain is like, do I try to get away and heal here or not? Tough. Oh man, it feels so good to do though, man. I will not be playing naked for my main playthrough. It is so difficult to play without a shield. I don't believe even a little. Y'all, I'm not that horny, okay? <laughs> oh, bitch ass. You horny bastards. It looks like a fake game from SVU. <laughs> <laughs> oh, come on. I got hit in the thigh by a stone. God, I thought I did it. Ah. I really want to show y'all what the purple one does. God damn it. Wow. No, come on, you gotta go back in there. Is the bottom boss the is the bottom bar the stagger? Yeah. The blocking is so lies up here, yeah. So sick, you know. Oh, I was too far away to even trigger that. Oh! Nice! Oh, 
Oh, come on. That didn't give you damage because you're like in a different mode. Go to hell. I'll just throw grenades at your feet, bitch ass. Alright, I better heal just to top up. Dude, I can never dodge fucking rocks just flying at me. <laughs> oh no. You gotta heal, son. Absolutely not. Absolutely not. Damn, so you do two grab moves with that. That's pretty sick. Ah! I fucking hate that move. That's some that's some guardian ape shit, man. <laughs> That's some guardian ape shit right there. When he just starts rolling around. I love seeing normal being challenging. Well, Is it hiding? I beat this in two tries when I wore a goddamn suit. <laughs> when you don't have a shield, it's a lot harder. Hey, hey, oh. <laughs> Oh, I did the purple thing. Dang it. I wanted to show y'all. God, this shit is just so fire, man. Holy shit, man. You're really bumming me out right now, Stalker. Oh, bullshit. That attack didn't count. Fucking stupid pebble, man. <laughs> it's bullshit. I was trying to throw a grenade down. You wouldn't let me. All right, final heal. That sucks. I dodged into that. No, I haven't watched. I haven't started Berserk yet. Yesterday was just a lot of work on this and TikToks and. Oh no, I used my last grenade there. Oh no, Guardian Ape time. Oh shit. Could have followed that up. No, why, why, why can't I follow that up? I'm so scared of that move. I forgot I have a fucking gun. I forgot I have a fucking gun, Chad. <laughs> yeah, eat shit. <laughs> <laughs> I forgot the, in the first time I played this I also forgot <laughs> this straight up Indiana Jones this dude
Hell yeah, Back dog. Thank you. Hilarious. <laughs> That's going to do it for this video, gamers. Did you enjoy it? Let me know in the comments down below. Do you plan on picking up Stellar Blade? Uh, I am. I would. Hey, YouTube, guess what? This video did end up getting uploaded. I know I said I was kind of hesitating the last time, but it, surprise, it is uploaded now. I uh, hope you enjoyed, and we'll see you next time, gamers. Goodbye.